What's going on YouTube? Gaming Bodybuilder back with a new video today, guys. Do you even lift, bros? If you don't, get to the gym. Nah, I'm just kidding. Um, so basically, guys, I want to talk to you about playing claw. Um, for, for those of you that don't know what claw is, it's when you're holding your Xbox controller. Basically, you use your index finger, uh, like as a claw, obviously. Uh, that's why they call it claw. Um, you use your index finger for the A button rather than playing default with your thumbs. You know, using the thumb to to go off the A button and and, and, and the thumbstick. You know, back and forth, back and forth to, to, to wall bounce and aim and stuff. So, <coughs> all a lot of the pros, probably all of the pros, run claw now, guys. Um, I kind of wish I did this a few years ago, but... I've been playing default for 10 years now and a friend of mine, shout out to a Tactics, Arif, shout out to my boy Arif, that kid's a god with uh, with the claw playstyle and he really got me, got me thinking about changing it up because the way the coalition's going with the game now, with Gears of War guys, um, it's it's forever changing the game's forever changing like this new this new 2.1 beta it's the mechanics of the game it it's just it's evolved it's nothing we've we've ever seen before so basically it's like a shortening of the wall bounce when you cancel the the wall bounce before you hit the cover then what that does is it reduces your your, your it reduces the range of the next next uh um, slide by up to 25% so you're only getting a 75% um, range to to hit your next wall so you know at first I hated it I'll be honest because it's completely different you know it's completely different it's changed the whole movement it's kind of slowed the game down a little bit but it's making it so People are just spamming the air button. You're using elite controllers with the paddles and just spamming the air button to try and get out of those those um, difficult situations without even really thinking about it. You know, it's, it's it's quite clever what the coalition are doing actually with this uh, beta, and it makes you really think about you know what wall should I take next, and you know I best hit that wall so I can reach the next one. It really makes you think about your gameplay and your game style. So, with that being said, I can't run default anymore, guys, because I'm just going to get left behind. So, I started using Claw on Tuesday. Um, no, Wednesday, sorry. I started using Claw Wednesday, went into a private game with my friend Arif, um, aka Tactics, and... Straight away, I just, I just, I disliked it, guys. It wasn't, it wasn't for me, you know. But my boy just kept saying, "Look, you got to stick it out." End of the day, if you want to practice with it and get better with it, then that's what you got to do. End of the day, you know. Um. So yeah, we was in a private match, just messing about and stuff, and I was getting the hang of it, but. It wasn't really going anywhere, so we decided to jump into a, a competitive 2.1, and that's where you're going to excel, guys. You know, don't be worried about getting killed or anything like that. Just jump straight into the competitive uh, side of the, of the game, and that's where you'll excel. That's where you'll, you know, you'll really practice it and you'll just pick up on it. And in my first game, guys, I managed to get 25 kills. That's the first game running claw after 10 years of default. So I was just like, whoa, you know, what, what's just happened there? Um, but it was like, it's, it's, I immediately, I just knew the benefits from, from running claw, even though I wasn't really feeling it and I wasn't used to it. But the benefits of your movement, um, the accuracy of your aiming as well, because you've always got your thumb on the right analog stick. You're never taking your thumb off the analog stick to try and wall bounce and, and roadie run and stuff. And you've got the claw to do all that. And your middle finger is already at that, 
you know it's already on the back bumper anyway it's already in that natural position for you to to fire with so that's just easy that comes easy guys um so yesterday well we're, we're day two for 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 myself running claw and i noticed it it does take like a good hour to to sort of like get used to it to really get into the into the game into the into the motion of of playing claw um but once 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 you warmed up guys it's it's honestly it's amazing i just can't believe it can't believe how good it is and i managed to pull mvp in a game as well which just blew me away i, I recorded a couple of clips obviously which i will share with you guys they're not the best clips because obviously you know day two a running claw um one of the pro players who plays for e united he were playing thumbs like playing thumbs in in major tournaments guys for cash prizes like it's not heard of for a pro player to do that and he did it amazingly as well but even he knew he had to switch up his play style and, and run claw and it took him two two months to master so however long it takes me to master i don't really care because one day i want to i want to join a team and i want to play play uh, play on land you know, play for cash prizes at tournaments and stuff. Like I am deadly serious about Gears of War, so I'm excited to see what happens with this new playstyle, guys. And I just wanted to share that with you. For all you Gears of War crazy fans out there, you know that are grinding the game, that are loving the game. Um, I really, I highly recommend that you you try play the the claw style, guys. Um, it will evolve your game just immensely honestly you know don't be disheartened don't don't go into a game running claw and then you're in there with 1v's and you switch back to playing thumbs because you're just cheating yourself and you're never going to get used to it because i felt like doing that myself as well uh, the other day i was in a couple of 1v's and i was like just i knew i could have them but i could beat them and obviously i wanted to switch back to to, to default just to kill them but I just stuck it out guys and that's it that's me now I'm, I'm 10 years of default boom that's done that's gone that's out of the window so I'm running claw now guys and it's the future so just want to shout out to my boy at tactics um, for really pushing me into into taking this next step into Gears of War and s hopefully someday soon guys I'll be streaming the game as well so once I get all that set up, it'll be nice to, to show you guys some some live gameplay with with the the, the new playstyle. So yeah, guys, sorry for for waffling on. I've kept you long enough. Just wanted to update you on on my new playstyle. I'm running Claw now, so you know the footage it's gonna be a bit sketchy, but nevertheless, guys, it's it's a whole new it's a whole new. Uh, it's a whole new game now and I'm ready for it. I'm Gaming Bodybuilder signing off guys. Take care. Peace.